Pet grooming combs are specifically designed for animal fur. They can get down to the roots to detangle, loosen, and remove dead hair. A good grooming comb is essential to the primping process. It's believed that the pets of British and French nobility were the first to be regularly groomed centuries ago. Today, a lot of pets receive the royal treatment. At this factory, pet combs start with bundles of long brass bars. A computer-guided saw slices them into six-inch pieces. Each piece will be transformed into a comb body. An employee inserts six of the brass pieces into a vise and tightens the clamps. A computerized drill carves dimples into the ends of each of the blanks. This is called a pre-drill. The drill returns to each dimple, producing precisely cut holes to join the comb body to a handle. Next, a computerized drill bores into the brass pieces, creating small holes for the comb's teeth. The spacing of the holes varies depending on the type of comb being made. Combs with tightly spaced teeth are used for finer fur. The combs are now ready for teeth. An employee inserts three comb bodies in a fixture, then grabs a handful of steel pins and pops them into the holes one by one. These steel teeth aren't sharp. They've been blunted to avoid hurting the animal during combing. She gently taps the steel teeth with a hammer to force them further into the holes. She brushes off any residual shavings from the earlier drilling. Then she places the combs on a demagnetizer. It erases any magnetic fields in the steel teeth that could compromise the chrome plating finish they will soon receive. Next, a punch sets the steel teeth in their final position. At another station, a device cuts extruded aluminum into shorter pieces. These pieces of aluminum will be the pet comb handles. Their contoured shape is designed for easy gripping. A worker clamps one of the handles in a fixture. It holds the handle steady as he drills rivet holes in both ends. The fixture also helps locate the holes through line channels called bushings. By drilling through the bushings, he produces accurate rivet holes every time. In the meantime, the comb assembly has been plated with a rust-resistant nickel and chrome finish. It's ready to be joined to the handle. An employee aligns the holes in the comb with the holes in the handle and places them in a riveter. The tool flattens the rivets against the handle on both sides. Then she dabs adhesive around the open ends of the handle and inserts plastic caps. She hammers the caps down. The glue sets quickly, creating a strong seal. After about a half hour of work, this pet grooming comb is now complete. It should last for many years. There will no doubt be many tangles ahead, but this comb will pull through them, and in the end, Fido will look and feel a whole lot better.